Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to episode 46. We've got a bit of a problem with the uh, the Indian menace. This is um, this is not good. I think this can be solved with nuclear weapons, though. The problem is, are we going to be able to get nuclear weapons over there in time, Mr. Kirill? Um, We can but hope. We can but hope. Because that's quite the army is amassed there. <laughs> it's just been building military units out of Delhi non-stop since the last peace treaty. The defence of that city as well, Madurai, however you pronounce it, it seems to be rising quite a bit, like, turn after turn. Somebody work the uranium. Thank you. I don't care if you're starving, you fucking shithole. Okay, now we've got to do something drastic, Mr. Kiryoff. We need to get nuclear weapons over to... Uh, these guys can be sold on the black market. Goodbye. They've done their work. Now uh, we need to... Get nuclear weapons into one of these cities as fast as possible. It's going to take 30 turns to actually build it there. That's oh, too long. That's... What about South Africa? Oh, it's 30 turns again. Come on. 24. We could kind of... We could increase it by working on the uh, production value of the cities, but uh, uh, it's kind of not worth it. Shit! Let's move this spy anyway before we make any decisions. Uh, let's spy on, spy on China again. Okay, so um, what the hell are we going to do? We're going to get rid of this religion from that city. That's what we're going to do. I don't. I don't think those cities can hold out for thirty turns. No. Even if we think we get it down fairly low, I don't think it's going to make much difference. I mean, we could build it like obviously probably up here somewhere, maybe like in London or somewhere with high production. But it would take a long time to get to the actual uh, area of impact. That's a bit harsh. That's a that's a bit harsh. There's no need for that. Absolutely no need. I think we'll take those workers as a uh, as payment for that insult to our glory. <laughs> it's tribute. Oh shit. Um. I th you know what? I don't think it makes any difference at this stage. I think if we just build, we need to build a nuclear bomb, stick it on a carrier. If they take over those cities, then they take them over. We've got the fleet. We can take it back. No, not the land ship. Good lord. Survives. Oh Survives! Steal the general for the win. Um, yeah, so I, I don't know. I, I I suspect we might lose those cities. But, yeah. on the other hand... <laughs> on the other hand, we could just nuke them. No, on the other hand... Um, <laughs> We're friends with Budapest. We should be able to take it back. And we can wipe his army with a nuke. Well, we need, we need more than one nuke to wipe his army out. Well, we can build three, so I suggest we build three. Well, I'm just thinking we Take do a hate cities. crime on his capital. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we didn't even kill him for you, dribbler. Do <laughs> You know what? No, I agree with that. Let's just do a hate crime on his capital. Fuck it. Trying to, we want to get rid of his uh, his artillery, his rocket artillery with these battleships. Oh yeah, because that's what's going to do the damage to the city is the fastest. So if we can get rid of that, that's fine. And HMS Kiri is an absolute animal when it comes to land combat. Good <laughs> lord! <laughs> ah, the carry has been built. So. I think Nottingham, yeah, look, nine terms of atomic, atomic bomb in Nottingham. We can put that on the carrier. Can we change we can we change uh, Nottingham to production as well? Just change, just switch everything over to production in Nottingham. Because then we can just slam out nukes. Eight turns. How much so we lost. Make? 
Well, it, it's it got one turn. turn off it. Okay. It's not too bad. Okay. <laughs> um. You know, actually, we could just build like we could build one here and nuke Gandhi, uh, nuke him. You know what? We may as well do that. Oh no, Hamburg! Build a fucking. Oh, it doesn't matter. You know, we'll build. We'll build a. Why isn't the production queue on? Yeah, build one there. Because <laughs> we'll just re rebase it and drop it all over Bismarck. These bastards in Russia can have one as well. Canterbury. <laughs> Aye, too long, Canterbury. Hastings, what can you do? 15, not bad, not bad. I think Berlin's got good production. No, no, Although, they, remember, they're still on gold focus as well, so... so yeah, but it isn't going to help that much, though. It isn't going to help that much, though. It isn't going to like... Every little helps. Every little helps. Every little helps. fucking three. No, fuck Every you, little man. Every little helps. It's, it's fine. Marseille, make, make money. But if they're staggered, we won't be able to do the uh, the ultimate drop of worth. I want to see all of them drop at the no, same no, no, time. No, no, don't worry. Don't worry. Build a shrine, because that helps us out. Uh, build a shrine, because uh, that helps us out. Kill the general. The ge d um, okay, I'll, I'll assist you in spelling this guy's name. Are you ready, sir? Do you have the archives open? I have the archives. Okay, oh, C H <laughs> C H A N D R A G U P T A space. I have him. Good lord. <laughs> Who is he? Because he's, <laughs> he he's about the, to die. In fact, he's dead. The founder of the Mauryan Empire and the first emperor to unify India into one state. Oh, so he's actually Indian. He's dead now. He's actually Indian. He's dead. Which he is was some, Indian. Uh, now he's gone. <laughs> Chinese work as well. This city is uh, invincible to our naval attack because we need more vessels down there. It's a shame Portland's in a bad state. It's not in a bad well, state. We it's, can't do look that. Look at it's it. A puppet state. Fucking millions of bananas. <laughs> it's fine. Got all the bananas they could possibly eat. The population is riddled with potassium poisoning, but look at this. Oh. Well, now, maybe, maybe she wants to fight Gandhi because she, she can see that he's actually fighting us and thinks, you know what, peace treat you with the English and then I'll uh, attack the uh, Indians. Or maybe she's just stupid. I don't know. But we also need to take her holdings away. No, I don't agree to this. Refuse. I don't agree to that. <laughs> <laughs> I think she just used it to build up her army. Look at She's this. seen what Gandhi did. It's a hate crime. She bombs our guys again. Well, they don't care. They don't care. They can take it all day. Nothing is going to compare to our hate crime. Absolutely nothing. Nothing compare. <laughs> oh. No. 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 <laughs> our hate crime against Gandhi. Oh. oh. That was so sickening, it made me sneeze. Once again, though, highly professional. Need the microphone, no one ever knows. Except I just said so. <laughs> Vajinga, 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 Ringa is in severe, <laughs> severe difficulty. Oh, shit. Do you want to pull the workers out? So sell them. Sell the workers before he gets them. The way forward. Something's going on with this Sam unit. It's just flashing. <laughs> well, I don't that think some units can attack the cities, so, so that's obviously okay. They have so much bloody military. Ah, Budapest have gave us some units. Thanks for that. <laughs> Why is it anything good? Better be good. Because if it's not good, then we don't want it. If it's not good, we'll nuke them. <laughs> How about that? That's, that sounds right. <laughs> Agra is starving. Well, oh yeah, we'll sell the works as well. Good, good show. Oh, we can't. Oh, well, we'll have to try later. Uh, oh, idiots. More on workers. Come on, HMS Kiri, get rid of these bastards with one shot. Uh, make it two then. 
they're, they're spread out. That's that's what I'm going to say there. They're spread out and in the bush. I think what we've got here is a case of uh, nuclear pro... This is basically Greenpeace. They don't like the fact of building nuclear weapons. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't see what the problem is. It's Not either that or be, it'll be crushed with our nuclear well, I mean, arsenal. It's either that or be crushed at the heel of Indian aggression. It's not going to happen. I think they gave us some bazookas, you know. That's quite nice. Oh, that's not bad. Nice of them. You've escaped a new king. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? They may as well go over there. In fact, there's a load of shit here. We can all go into... Russia, because we're gonna, we've got to explode onto the scene again in massive global warfare. That's what taught these idiots a lesson last time, oh. so... Oh, oh that was a uh, injection of cash. <laughs> oh, look oh, at this. That, look at that. She's almost there. She's almost there to lay siege to Ningbo. There's a... Is that another cargo ship there? Oh. Good lord. Good lord. Oh. What's this? Well, well, a little, nice little cash injection there. You, you're joking. Oh, me. come on. What the hell? That is disgusting. I cannot believe that man ship still lives. What a hero. A hero of our times. Mm. Guerrilla warfare in the mountains by the land ship. I think he's in we the. Could do a uh, smash Himalayas, could snatch and, yeah, could do a snatch and grab on the worker. <laughs> snatch driving, <laughs> and then run away. Is that no? That's not what it's called, is it? Snatch and grab. I've just made that up. <laughs> no, I think it is. Smash and grab. Is Smash and grab. Smash and grab. That's snatch it. and Snatch grab. and grab what is the, the same thing, ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> Can you grab it? Then grab it again. Yeah. Oh. 28 turns, I'll make it back home to be sold. Privateer is, uh, well, it may as well just stay there. He's doing us proud. He's doing well, good work, the privateer. HMS Q can't do anything, so he's just going to have to stay there. The Admiral. Oh, I forgot we still had Formio. <laughs> Formio! More hate crimes. Oh, baby. It's never going to be enough to take it out, but on the other hand, it is quite funny, so it's fine. Ah, but look who's entered the fray. <gasps> Indefatigab. Yeah, Indefatigab has arrived. Let's move her in, and then let's fire on the tanks. Yes. Yeah. Mm, I don't think she's she's only got one shot in her in her belly, but that's fine. Ah, oh, god damn it! It's going to help though. Every, yeah, yeah, it'll, it'll, it'll have to do. It'll have to do. You're like an extremely bad advert for Tesco. I, I don't know why that's in my, It's just in my head. I don't know why. <laughs> every little helps. Every little helps. Oh, God, every little helps. <laughs> well, I've been poisoned by the communist agenda. Oh, not shit. Communist. I think this is gone. Capitalist. Communist. Not, not, not communist. No, no, no. It lives. I'm losing my mind. I'm absolutely losing my mind. It's got to live. It's got to live. Attack of a billion missiles is underway. It, it appears that we're firing missiles out of the, uh, like the, the skyscrapers, like the the, the 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 offices in the apartment complexes are somehow equipped with long-range ballistic missiles. Yeah, but that oh, was wasn't oh, that, oh, wasn't that oh, one of the policies? Oh. oh. I that one of the policies, a rocket launcher in every home. I'm pretty sure we, we put that out as the tagline. Is that why we got voted in? In fact, yeah, I voted myself in. <laughs> and then when you said a rocket launcher in every, in, every, in every home, everyone was like, yeah, okay, <laughs> that's fine. We'll take that. It's not a problem. A good one. Yes. Should. Okay. Let's maximise our damage on these units. So... We'll use Indefatigab. <coughs> hmm. Right, let's use Kiri. We need, to, we need to get rid of this. Maybe he kills it in one. He doesn't. So he's got another attack. He can attack the... I don't know, I guess he can attack those power troopers. This guy can attack that and hopefully kill it. I 
fucking hell. I mean... <sighs> God. I think... For Chikavinga, he's gone. I think it's his final. It's final. Final Bro. stand. The last stand. It's uh, fought well, though. It's fought well, undeniably. It faced overwhelming opposition with very little military support on our side, and it lasted. Well, Yolundi's got uh, another battleship. Which can go <laughs> we've over got minus talk. one aluminium. How is that possible? <laughs> I think we've got too many... Uh... I don't know. I really do not know. I think we've got more units than we, we can we can have or some shit. But it doesn't take them away from us. I don't know, bro. I really don't know. So now we need to look at what we're going to actually do. So we could go for combined arms and get tanks. And we can't build the Pentagon because Gandhi built that ages ago. Well, to I... To be honest. I, uh, advanced ballistics so we can build nuclear missiles and fire them straight from the seas. <laughs> Going straight for the ice TPMs. Yeah. <laughs> We'll start things off nice and slow with uh, dropping them from planes. And then, as they're trying to recover from that, we'll start flinging them around the world, attached to missiles, and see how they like that. We need to get a I suspect they won't like Ningba. it either way. But... Ningba! Ah, we don't have vision. Maybe we just move in range. No, we still don't have vision. Fuck! Fuck! I think he can attack HMS Victory as well. Oh no, she can move out of the way. <laughs> HMS Victory ain't gonna get attacked, what are you talking about? <laughs> okay. Oh no, the unit needs orders, as in it just needs to go to sleep. Jesus Christ, game. Jesus. Yes. See this fleet, we could... No, we'll leave this fleet here, screw it. Just, just attack, more hate crimes. Hate crimes are good. <laughs> <laughs> how, how are the Americans getting on actually we haven't even really checked him Sell. I think that was level 13 last time I looked um, yep yeah, it's it's growing it's growing we're starting to search America for nuclear material yeah because <laughs> that's what we look for I think we'll go north into Canada I'm kind oh, of God. a bit disturbed about the fact we found nothing in terms of nuclear material outside of the stuff in the US. I feel like it's being hidden from us and I don't I don't appreciate that. <laughs> but look at the damage we've done to Gandhi's armed forces. I mean this is the disgusting loss he's taken really. He does it every time, doesn't he? He goes after the cities and he loses way more than he's ever gonna gain by trying to take them back. Ah. Oh. Uh -oh. oh! Please! Mm. Please! There's a couple of units that are really low. We could take that artillery out with one shot. Well, with two shots from HMS Kiri. But maybe we can move these ships down and maybe kill one of these and another one. I think it might still die on its turn, though. I think it will. Yeah, it I doesn't matter so. though, because we can take these cities back with our navy. We'll have to strengthen it a bit, but would we be better sending the navy down and getting get in that little lonely Indian place first? Get our foothold there and then what, come here? back. Yeah, yeah. Because we need to explore that area for for nuclear material. So if we take that, because it'd be easy to take that with three battleships, we'll destroy it. And then we can go back to Agra and Vajinga Ringa, Slinga Majinga, Meninga. <laughs> Slingy Majinga, you bastard. Slingy Majinga. Uh, we can go back. We can go back to that and take it back. After we've hate crime his capital. Because we, we can load the new guns of ship and just drive it in range. Hate, hate crime, crime capital, capital. <laughs> <laughs> and then just go oh oh yes I'll have to be careful of Agra though because that, that'll be able to attack him I know but it's not going to do much damage to him 
I sort of want to get the... Uh... You see, this is going to fall on the next turn, but what we'll do... We'll kill that infantry... Oh, come on. Whatever, we'll kill that infantry unit, it doesn't matter if it takes a round of attack. This ship's got two shots, so it can kill that and that. No, it can kill that and that, sorry. We'll do that. Let's check the ranges. It can still move afterwards as well, can't it? So. Inflict maximum losses. Okay. Make him pay for every inch. Oh, crap. The Indian culture's getting quite influential. I don't understand why. He hasn't got any culture. He's just a megalomaniac. <laughs> We've got no culture. Yeah, he's just a fucking scumbag. Look at him. Minus 20 public. What the hell? What a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> I don't class that as a victory anyway. Culture. I mean, get lost. Ningbo. Welcome to HMS Victory. Enjoy your stay. <laughs> Absolutely loved every second of it. Oof! Oof. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to lose our private oh, here. Oh well. It was suicidal, but suicidal in a good way. He loved it. He loved every second of it. <laughs> Given a chance to prove himself, what more could you ask for? Right. Gonna hate crime. Yeah, but hate crime is getting us nowhere. We've got a ship somewhere there. A new battleship. So I still think if we send the other two down there, we can take that place and begin our expansion into the into the banal on a will. I don't know. I mean, I know we've already got Portland, but Portland's a bit of a shithole, let's face it. It's got no anything. Mind you, I don't think Majora has got anything either. It's just got bananas too, but that's not the point. It belongs to Gandhi. And taking it would be a blow to his resources. So. <laughs> it was a crazy idea sending that in. Oh dear. We need to pull back that destroyer as well, because that's the way of capturing the city. Look at him dropping paratroopers. Come on, city. Oh no. <laughs> then that leaves. Don't believe it. The jinga mininga slinga ninga. It's gone finally. Gandhi's built the Pentagon. I thought he built that earlier. Yeah, I thought he got that. That's God's sake, Gandhi. I mean, where the hell is Gandhi's empire? Oh, Gandhi. He can't be that big. I mean, he's only here. He's only there, Gandhi. Is he's not here? Hasn't he got another little thing on Australia, or am I just made that up? I might have just made that up. Like down the bottom. Oh yeah, but one city, Bangalore. Oh, Shaka Khan's there as well. God damn it, Shaka. Oh fuck it, he's been range. Tell me that isn't in range of attack. Canterbury. Canterbury. You know what? I think uh I think we should sit down in Canterbury, have a cup of tea with the Archbishop. Have a tour of the cathedral. The cathedral <laughs> of nuclear worth. <laughs> in the heart of the cathedral there's a single piece of uranium <laughs> glowing green. <laughs> And to become the to become the archbishop, you have to. You uh, gotta lick it. Yeah, you gotta <laughs> ingest part of the fucking crystal. This is going a bit Diablo. This is where he puts a crystal in his head at the end of the first one. Uh, anyway, um, we'll uh, we'll we'll catch you next time, people. Toodaloo.